This is kind of the first one done if, if you turn the wrong way. You could look at it like that, but also look. It's not circular me, so it's kind of natural to turn towards it rather than to turn away from it. So you can see it that way. So it's exactly the same then. So you're just turning slightly different. There's a very natural way to go, following him round. Could even be that if you're circling, you're oh, trying and then you fail to get that, so you, you're trying to swish him away. Oh, <laughs> circles, circles, yeah. Yeah. There isn't one solution to situations in Aikido, they don't arise in only one context. And you can see them like there's levels of meaning here. What I didn't emphasize, but there is really a tilt in this one. <coughs> so I'm coming this way and I pivot on that point. And that's a different principle. It's like a time anchor, pivoting around the point. And then under. See that's come up a bit, but I can pull it down. You should hold his arm with this technique, otherwise he can just step away from it. If you do nothing here, he can just walk away. You can also hold there. But in a lot of ways it's better. For those of you getting a bit stuck with the arm lock. And I come under there, and this arm is stiff. It's easy to lock it. It's an easy lock. That's a lock you can't find in many places. That's why it's not done very often. <laughs>